Hi, I'm Dr. Jerry Bell of NOAA's Climate Prediction Center. Each year, my team makes a prediction for the Atlantic hurricane season. This is not a landfall forecast, but an outlook of how many storms might develop during the season and how strong they will be. Hurricane season runs from June 1st to November 30th, so now is a good time to prepare for what the coming months might bring. NOAA is predicting that a near-normal season is most likely this year. The Atlantic hurricane season will likely produce a range of 10 to 16 tropical storms, of which 4 to 8 are expected to become hurricanes. 1 to 4 of those hurricanes are expected to become major hurricanes of category 3 or higher. This predicted activity suggests that the season could be more active than we've seen during the last three years. Because of strong climate variability and key climate factors during the past few years, there is uncertainty as to whether there will be reinforcing or competing climate influences on tropical storm and hurricane development this year. Now we've been in an era of high activity for tropical storms since 1995, but we're seeing signs that this era could be ending. The high activity era is marked by warmer Atlantic Ocean temperatures in association with the warm phase of the Atlantic Multidecadal Oscillation or AMO, and also with a stronger West African monsoon. However, during the last three years, weaker hurricane seasons have been accompanied by cooler Atlantic Ocean temperatures and a weaker West African monsoon. Also, there's uncertainty about the extent to which El Nino and La Nina will influence the hurricane season. El Nino is now dissipating, but its impacts could extend into the early part of the hurricane season. We are then forecasting a 70% chance, chance for La Nina to develop and to be present during the peak months of the hurricane season, August through October. La Nina favors more hurricane activity. However, model predictions vary as to how strong this La Nina and its impacts will be. Given these variable climate patterns, a near normal season is most likely. But I want to underscore that a near normal season does not mean that we're off the hook or that there won't be impacts. Take action now to be prepared for the hurricane season. Once a storm approaches, it's often too late to get ready. Update your family evacuation plans and communication plans and restock your emergency supply kit and also reevaluate your flood insurance needs. Together, we can build a weather-ready nation, one that is resilient to the impacts of hurricanes and tropical storms.